It's always taken. It really don't matter if I lose this fight. It really don't matter if this guy opens my head either. Because all I want to do is go to distance. And if I can go that distance, you see, and that bell rings and I'm still standing, I'm going to know for the first time in my life, you see, that I weren't just another bum from the neighborhood. Friends, Coffin Link. I sold him. Uh, I know you sold him. Remember you were working at that pet shop, huh? The first day you was there and I came in and bought both these animals, huh? How you feeling this morning, huh? Full of life. Fine. Hey, how you doing, killer? How's the turtle food this week? Fine. You know, the last turtle food I got here had more moss in it than flies. You know that, Adrian? And these moths, they get caught in the turtle's throat right about here in his cough, right? I gotta smack them on the back of the shell. What do you think they get? Huh? And they get what? Huh? Come on. Show shot. They get show shot. Hey, how's my buddy doing today? Yo, bud kids. Yo, bud kids. Adrian, I want you to go downstairs and clean all the cat cages. They're a mess. Hey, crime don't pay. You know that, Gloria. You know that. <sighs> Tough day today, you know? They took my locker away. I had that locker for about six years, but don't bother me none. Lockers are bad anyway. After a while, people get the combination. I must have had 20 bucks taken out of there in the past six years, you know? Don't sound like much, but it adds up. You know? Doesn't matter. Who cares, you know? You need somebody to walk you home, you know? Hmm? No. No? All right, listen, I'm going to go now, OK? Listen, I'll see you later, all right? None of you guys get up. I know you had a hard day in the cage, right? So uh, I'm going to go home, make up a joke. I'm going to tell you a new joke tomorrow, OK? Good night, Adrian. Good night, Rocky. You know, tomorrow's Thanksgiving, you know that? Why don't you come over and talk to her? Sure. Yeah. Tomorrow you come for some bird, right? Absolutely. You got it. I gotta go. From 10 minutes late, she calls the hospital. Who's this girl you're going out with tomorrow night? How'd you know? Ah, uh, you know. Don't you think I hear things? A lot of canaries flying around the docks. I'm going out with Paulie's sister. <laughs> hey, Ralph. What? Hey, she's retarded. Hey, this bum got to say that. All right, back it up, buddy. I'm calling back you up. a bum. Okay. Hey, right. your sister, you sure your sister knows I'm coming? Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's very excited. Yeah? Call the hospital. Yo, how you doing? I told you she's very excited. Holy, why didn't you tell me you were bringing him here? You look at me, I'm not ready for this. It would make a difference if you were. Look, he's a friend, and now he's taking you out. No, I can't. Well, you're in the kitchen, and I want you out right now. Oh. Hey. Yo, Adrian, it's me, Rocky. Rocky, you know? Listen, uh, I don't know what to say, because I ain't never talked to no door before, you know? I mean, what do I say to a door? Hey, listen, I never forget something. You're doing fine. I ain't doing fine. I look like an idiot. Keep doing what you're doing. Funny. So, uh... How about maybe you and I, maybe we'll go out together, get something to eat. I don't know, maybe laugh a little bit. Who knows, you know? Would you like to, uh... I don't know, would you like to maybe, uh, you know, you and me go out together? What do you think? Would you like to? Yeah. 
gonna have a good time. I'll have a real good time, man. If you could let her on the ice, I'd appreciate it. Only for a few minutes. You have the ice to yourself. Ten bucks. You're a pretty good skater, aren't you? <laughs> well, my father, he's uh, my old man. He was never too smart. He says to me, you weren't born much of a brain, you know, so uh, you better start using your body, right? So I've become a fighter. Oh. You know what I mean? Yeah. Why you, why you left? My mother, she said the opposite thing. What'd she say? What'd she say the opposite? She said you weren't born much of a body, so you better develop your brain. Did she say that? I don't understand why anybody would want to be a fighter. Hey, you got to be a moron. you got to be a moron to want to be a fighter, you know what I mean? It's a rock where you almost guaranteed to end up a bum. I don't think you're a bum. Well, I'm at least half a bum, you know? But I'll tell you something. Hey, I got some animals. I got these rare, very rare animals inside. Come on. Come on no, in. No, no, I got to go. Hey, look at his face. Is that a face you can trust or what? Huh? Is it? I'm going to stick this face on a stamp. What do you think? I remember when she was standing there, all nervous and shy with this little smile. And all I wanted her to do was trust me. Huh? Come on. Come on in. She did. You want to sit down? Do you have a phone? Who'd you want to call? I want to let my brother know where I am. Why? I think he might be worried. Well, I'll call your brother if that's the problem. Yo, Paul Lee, your sister's with me. I'll call you back later. See ya. I don't see you. What's the attraction? I don't know. Fills gaps, I guess. What's gaps? I don't know, gaps. She's got gaps, I got gaps. Together we fill gaps. I don't know. Oh, what's this doing in your ear? What? Oh, God. Oh, yeah. I, yeah. yeah. You, uh, I remember when you took them off. That's right. First time I ever kissed you, remember? Do me a favor. What? You take off these last. You got nice eyes, you know. Do me another favor. Just take off that hat. I always knew you was pretty. Don't tease me. Not teasing you. I ain't teasing you. You don't want to kiss me back if you don't want. You, you lay off that pet shop day. Women weaken legs. Want me to rub you down? No, I'm just, I'm just sore. Okay, I'll just, just sit here. You sure? Yeah, I'm sure. Yeah, but I really like this girl, you know. But let her train you. Hey, hey, come on, no fooling around, right? I'm tired. Hey, AJ, I'm serious now. There's no fooling around during training. You understand? I want to stay strong. You're not kidding. No, I ain't kidding. Yo. It's okay. I'm sorry. Hey. Hey. Oh. Yo, you look great. Really? Oh, yeah. Terrific. I mean, you could be a heartbreak. 
Go walk down the street breaking hearts the way you're looking. Very sharp. I got, I got another surprise for you. What? Hey, bud kids! Hey, bud kids! Come here, kid! Come here! To keep you company when you run! Oh, 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 Snowing, mm -hmm. everything smelled fresh. There was this tiger, he had snow on its back, and he's walking in the background. Okay, I, I get it, I get it, I get it. Just tell me what you said. Well, I was getting to that point. What I said is that. What do you think you're doing for like the next uh, 40 or 50 years? What do you mean? I was wondering if. Uh, you wouldn't mind marrying me very much. What'd you say? If you wouldn't mind marrying me too much. Yes. I'd like to marry you. Yeah? Yes. <laughs> yeah? Yes. And she made me better than I deserve to be. Be a good guy, I promise. Ma che bel uomo. Volete prendere Adriana Pennino qui presente per la vostra moglie? Yeah, absolutely, yes. Adriana Pennino, volete prendere a Rocky Balboa qui presente per vostro marito? I do. Thanks. There are two kinds of love that you ought to know. There are two kinds. Oh, we are. I got proof in my pocket. Everything happened so fast. Yeah, but I knew what was going to happen from the start. What did you know? Well, the first time I seen you, I says to myself, I says, <laughs> even though this girl is suffering from the disease of being shy, underneath them uh, sweaters and hat and what'd you have on? About 20 sweaters, was it? No, uh, three. Yeah, three sweaters is the best girl in Philly, you know? Uh -huh. Oh, yeah, I said that. I said that. Really? Oh, yeah. You think it'll always be like this? Yeah. I hope you. What? You never get tired of me. Oh, no. You ain't never get rid of me. Expensive, you know. Well, hey, do you like having a good time? That's a great spot for a bag. You know, I can teach you how to work that bag someday, you know? <laughs> yeah? Yes. Yo, Adrian, you did it! <laughs> how do I look? The best. Fabulous. Adrian, how do I look? Different. I got canned today. What happened? I don't know. It was, uh, well, you know, it's nobody's fault. They were just cutting back, you know, it was economics. What are you going to do? I don't know. I was, uh, thinking about fighting. What about Uriah? You know, the doctor said you shouldn't fight anymore. No, no. <laughs> he recommended that I don't fight, and I recommend that I do. You go blind. Nobody's going blind. Honest, I see great. I see like a beagle or something like that. Oh, Rocky, you gave me your word you wouldn't fight anymore. I mean, if we need money, I could get a job. I, I, I can get my job back, you know, part time at the pet shop. But I'm the one who's supposed to support. 
It's just for a little while. So what if you catch some pet shop disease or something? There no pet shop diseases, Rocky. I mean, I really I want to work. You know, I was thinking that uh, I ain't supposed to do no commercials, and I ain't supposed to work in no meat house. I'm supposed to be a fighter. But you gave that up. Mm. Yeah, I think I'm becoming nobody again, too. In whose eyes? Not mine. In mine. In here. I don't want you to get by the hard way, you know? I want you to have good things. I want the kid to have good things. Oh, Rocky, please. You don't have to prove anything. Peter, it's all I know. I don't want you to do it. It's all I know. Rocky. I'm sorry. Yo, Rock. What's the matter with my sister? Your head ain't screwed on right. Nah, no, come on. I'm doing okay. You know what? Uh... Come on. My sister got you so guilty you're running all over the place. She'll be all right. No, it ain't all right. Boy, it's okay, all right? It's not okay. Yeah, just leave AJ alone, all right? Come across and tell him it's all right. Come it's not all right, Paulie. If he goes blind, you walk away. I can't. I love him. Get out! What are you doing? How's AJ? Either. Where is AJ? What are you doing? She's had complications. Like what? Your wife was hemorrhaging when she was brought in. Now, the premature delivery was most likely caused by straining of overwork, and the sudden loss of blood has caused her to slip into a coma. Are you mad because Adrian left you? She didn't leave, Paul. She died. I read where your wife passed on a while back. I always heard she was a nice person. Yeah, this. Listen, I got this uh, place, this restaurant, nice little eatery. And uh, if you ever get a chance, it'd be great. Both of you just come down there and eat and every day would be great. I'm usually here all the time, so if you're ever in the neighborhood, come by. Well, I'm a girl. What's a girl? Well, she'll be everything I'm not. She won't have to be shy. Oh. And if it's a boy, I'd like him to be just like the father. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Don't you think one dumbbell in the family is enough, huh? <laughs> I'll tell you one thing, this kid ain't gonna get no tattoos. They ain't gonna be hanging on no corners. They ain't gonna dress like no wise guy like me. I'll tell you that. It's gonna be a good somebody like you. Like you? No, 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 like you. You ought to come by the restaurant tonight. I can have something made special for you. Tonight I can't. I got plans. A few of the guys get together, you know. Did I do something wrong? What, what, what do you mean? Well, <laughs> well I, I don't know exactly what I mean, but I just think it's like when I come here, you don't feel so comfortable, and I, I certainly don't want to do that. Well, you, you throw a big shadow. That's the cartoon fight I'm telling you about. Did you train him too? He just didn't like fighting, didn't take to it. We're trying to raise our son so he can handle his problems with his mind. That's why I'm going to get mangled. Come on, do you want to grow up and just use your fists? You know, AJ, well, Adrian, I don't think it'd be so bad if I taught him how to throw a few deadly punches, you know? <laughs> no, I, you know, I, I just want to get your opinion on something. Sure. Opinion on what? I think I want to, like, do something. Like what? Fight. You know, nothing big, small stuff, like, locally. Don't you think you're too... You know, old? Yeah, but you think you ought to stop trying things because you had a few too many birthdays? I do not. People are going to think you're going crazy. 
So this isn't a mental disturbance? No. That computer fight got people curious. This could be very interesting. Don't you care what people think? Doesn't it bother you that, that people are making you out to be a joke and that I'm gonna be included in that? Do you think that's right? Do I really care about standing toe to toe and all that stuff? Or, or like my kid says, is it just like ego? Or am I like this old pug who's just trying to replace old pain with new pain? I don't know. I, I, I don't know. Rocky, the press has labeled you a Balboasaurus. <laughs> <laughs> you wanna go blind? I mean, I get pissed, this guy get hurt. Balboa is no challenge. It's physically impossible for this little man to win. Rocky! Give it some time. Don't do this. A lot of people live with hurt. Agent, a lot of people don't have a choice, I do. And for that, you're willing to lose everything? It's a lot more than this, Adrian. Before, there were reasons to fight I could understand, but I don't understand this. Why can't you change your thinking? Everybody else does. Because I'm a fighter. That's the way I'm made, Adrian. That's what you marry. We can't change what we are. How's everybody doing out there? Everybody, oh, everything's okay. What's wrong? What's wrong? Remember when Mick said when he was fighting, sometimes he fights so hard that he was thinking that he broke something inside and he was gonna die, and that's. What he said, that's when the angels was pulling on him. Rocky, you're scared. I don't, I don't. What's wrong? I can't. I can't stop my hands from shaking. There are rumors of physical complications after the fight. Complication? No, no, those, those were rumors. He's in... He's in perfect physical condition. Because of the continuous violent blows to the head, you've developed a condition particular to boxers called cavum septum folliculum. The effects are irreversible. Oh, Rocky, you, you have to retire. I, I don't want to retire, you know? This ain't the time to retire, no, not in here. Had no office. Oh, Rocky, you suffered severe brain trauma. Well, he could be wrong. Anybody could be wrong. I don't think he is. Well, he ain't God. Look, Agent, only God ain't wrong. Hey, Rocky. The Medical Advisory Board has informed us that the battery of tests to which you've been subjected, you've passed these tests with flying colors. And we congratulate you for that. Thanks. However, this commission, in good conscience, cannot recommend you for a license and we therefore deny your application. You can't go with what you are. Have you read the papers? Do you know what everybody says? It's suicide! Oh, look, I'm are you this. trying to talk my husband into fighting again? I'm offering you your last golden opportunity to dump this loser image. Who are you talking to? Angel, you ain't working across the... Hey, whoa, oh, whoa, oh, what the hell are you two people talking about, huh? This is a tremendous opportunity. Opportunity for who? For you to make money, for him to be disabled? What would you do if the choices were reversed? You have to think about that. Rocky, they don't care about you. It just takes one bad hit, and you could be an invalid. Well, I feel like an invalid already. Why do you got to come back here? You're too smart for this place here. I got nothing to do. Gloria, I called Gloria, she said. You know, she could use some part-time help. Yeah, but why do you want to do this, Adrian? Why do you want to go back to the same place you started from? I got to do it, but you don't got to do it. I wanted to be there so I could be close to you. All right, yeah. You know, it's getting a little cold out here. Maybe it's okay. Maybe we better get inside, okay? I understand. Are you all right? What? Are you all right? Yeah, I'm all right. It's getting cold, okay? You know, so, sometimes it's hard to breathe. You know, I feel like this beast inside me. It's okay, Rocco. Please, it's okay. Is it? We got room down in the basement. It's not, you know, it's nice. I don't know. What about me? Wait, Mr. Sweetheart, your, your son is sleeping down. No, I, 
Well, you can stay with his uncle, right? Hello, my pit stop. Nice. Hey, I, I don't want to cause any problems. I mean, I can find some place to stay. No, I, it's okay, you know, it's just for uh, a little while, you know. You know this guy? Yeah, he hits hard. Tommy Gunn, you got some guns, don't you? I know when somebody like Tommy comes along, you feel alive. But he's not you, he doesn't have your heart. But it's my where's the highway. If there's something you want to pass on, pass it on to your son. For God's sakes, your son is lost. He needs you. You said I would be number one to you. You said that and you lied. You lied to me and you lied to mom. I never lied to you. Tommy needed my help. So did I. I just wish... I had done a better job with the kid, you know? I didn't raise him right. You still live around here? No, he moved to a place called Vancouver with his girlfriend. I think they're having a great old time up there. And, you know, I hear from him now and then, but it was tough for him to live in Philadelphia and you know, me and all that stuff. So, you know, Rocky's son, well, he's, he's happy. I'm happy for him. He's a nice kid, smart kid, young. Reminds me of me, fast. He's got nobody. I got nobody. And I like to leave something behind. Cause, you know, I'm gonna keep taking everything. You gotta leave something. That's what it's all about, right? So if you don't mind, and I know you don't, I wanna be in this corner. Yeah. Biopsy oh. came back showing signs of large cell non-Hodgkin's lymphoma. What's that do? Well, it's a form of cancer. Rocky? I know that sounds scary, but the good news is we caught it early. However, we will have to remove the tumor in your lymph nodes and start chemotherapy immediately. I've tried that. Mr. Balboa, as far as options for treatment, this is the best plan of action. No, I understand, but my wife tried that, and uh, I don't think I want to do it. It didn't turn out so good, but it's OK. If you don't jump on this quick, you're going to end up dying. I know. And you are right with that? I am. And I'm just tired. I just, okay. I just want to go home, OK? If I could take everything that was good and put it into a bowl or something and say, hey, here, I'd like to buy one more day with my wife, I'd do it. I would die a happy man right then. Not gonna happen. Can I talk to you? I just don't want it no more. It's just, you've never quit anything since I've known you. What you want me to say? I mean, how? What, what happened? How did everything that was so good get so bad? What's so bad? Tell me what. I wrecked everything by not thinking for myself. I never fought anybody who was all in the prime. It was always some angle to hold on to the title longer than I should have had it. And so we wouldn't have had the title as long. So what? At least it would have been real, Adrian. Hey, it was real. Nothing is real if you don't believe in who you are. I don't believe in myself no more, don't you understand? That's not it! That is it! Why don't you tell me the truth? What are you putting me through, Adrian? You want to know the truth? The truth is I don't want to lose what I got. In the beginning, I didn't care about what happened to me. I go in a ring, I get busted up, I didn't care. But now there's you, there's the kid. I don't want to lose what I got. What do we have that can't be replaced? What? A house, we got cars, we got money. We got everything but the truth. I loved you, man. You blew it. You know that? You and me were supposed to be like this, Tommy. That fight should have been stopped. I should have stopped. Hey, Adrian, take care of him. Take care of him. Everything I got is moved on, and I'm here. What's the truth, damn it? I'm afraid, all right? You want to hear me say it? You want to break me down? All right, I'm afraid. For the first time in my life, I'm afraid. I'm afraid, too. There's nothing wrong with being afraid. There is. For me, there is. Why, you're human, aren't you? Look, I don't know what I am. All I know is I'm a liar, 
and because of that Mickey ain't here no more. You didn't push him into anything. He was a grown man and he did what he had to do. And you have no right to feel guilty for what happened. You don't. You were a champion and you did what you were expected to do. And you did what I and everybody else thought you should do. And you want to tell me that those fights weren't real, that you were carried? Well, I don't believe it. It doesn't matter what I believe because you're the one that's got to carry that fear around inside you. Get rid of it. Because when all the smoke is cleared and everyone's through chanting your name, it's just going to be us. And you can't live like this. We can't live like this. Because it's going to bother you for the rest of your life. Look what it's doing to you now. But I think you're a hell of a lot more than that, kid. A hell of a lot. And if I lose? And you lose. But at least you lose with no excuses. No fear. And I know you can live with that. Adrian always tells the truth. How'd you get so tough? I... I live with a fighter. I couldn't stay away anymore. I'm with you, no matter what. No matter what? No matter what. I really love you. I love you. There's one thing I want you to do for me. Win. Win. Now I'm asking you as a favor not to go through with this, okay? This is only gonna end up bad for you, and it's gonna end up bad for me. You ain't gonna believe this, but you used to fit right here. I say to your mother, this kid's gonna be the best kid in the world. But somewhere along the line, you changed. You let people stick a finger in your face and tell you you're no good. And when things got hard, you started looking for something to blame, like a big shadow. Cowards do that, and that ain't you! It takes a hell of a man to change. If you did it, you're gonna prove it to him tonight, right? The world ain't all sunshine and rainbows. It's a very mean and nasty place, and I don't care how tough you are, it will beat you to your knees and keep you there permanently if you let it. There ain't no cats! There's no cats! But it ain't about how hard you hit. It's about how hard you can get hit and keep moving forward. How much you can take and keep moving forward. That's how winning is done. One more round. Oh my God. You gotta be willing to take the hits. All those beatings you took in the ring, I took them with you. Hit him. Just hit him. Oh yeah. You're the best. You're the best. The last round of your life. All your strength, all your power, all your know, everything you've got! Except for my kid being born. <laughs> this is the greatest night in the history of my life. I just want to say one thing to my wife at home. Yo, Adrian! I did it!
You're my son, you're my blood. You're the best thing in my life. But until you start believing in yourself, you ain't gonna have a life. Don't forget to visit your mother. I tried calling our son, Bobby, a few times, but I'd hang up every time he was about to pick up because, to tell you the truth, I didn't know what to say to him. I mean, what if he's moving on and I'm like this chunk of yesterday trying to be today? It just don't fit in. I mean, what am I supposed to do? Knock on his door and say, hey, how you doing? What's it been, a lot of years? I don't know. Hey, Robert. I know I made a few mistakes, you know, that's... And I would love to hang out with you again. Just you and me. I swear to God, it's just gonna be you and me this time. Home team? Yeah, home team. This is your grandfather. <sighs> you look just like his mother. <laughs> yeah, I know. You're the real champ around here. I made this for you. Oh, yeah. Give me that. It's good, but it's not dodo. It's do 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 do. Do 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 do. That's good enough. Do I've been told. Do, 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 do. By people in the uh Do, 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 do. Is there to take me back? Take me back like fool. I don't call this a reason. Just call it believe. Is this you? Yeah, that's me when I was eight years old. That's the Italian stallion when it was a baby. I just dislocated my finger. Look at that. No, no, no. Hey, wait, hey, hey. It ain't your fault. Look. Has it been that rough? <laughs> <laughs> no. What I saw before. Don't leave town. You're the best thing ever come to my crazy life. You know that? Huh? You better head for the canyon. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> From my life as a seed. Starting now, it's gonna have more feet, girl, girl, girl. Uh, 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 ooh, come on. Yo, Adrian, we did it, didn't we? I brought you something. I hope you don't mind, I took it from the restaurant. Thanks. Yeah. Adrian. Yeah. Thought you'd keep you safe, you know. Yeah. Adrian always brought me luck. Yeah. Remember when we was on ice skates? But I kept giving you lip, and you kept trying to slip so I could catch you. So now I want you to know that wherever you go, don't worry about a thing. Because as long as I got this ring, I'll always be there to catch you. You know, I could have done nothing without you. Yo, Adrian, we did it. We did. You remember a long time ago, I told you that, uh, I said that, you ain't never getting rid of me. Remember that? 